question just about the most, well, it says coolish slash most memorable sound effect experience, but I guess most memorable is probably a better better one to use since you probably <laughs> love them all, like we all love sound. Yeah, you know, there's so many, there's so many things that, so many experiences that have happened over the last 24 years recording. You know, I think the thing that I, in, aside from just the recordings, the thing I love most about sound effects recording is you get to learn about people and culture. And when I, I'm not, you know, referring to people from far off locations, I'm referring to people even in America or Canada who, say, are into planes, they're into race cars, they're into go-karts, uh, they're, you know, with the Navy, with their Air Force. You get to really learn and bring yourself into their culture. And that's probably the most exciting thing about sound effects recording is that if you want to record something properly, you really need to learn who the people are and learn about their culture. Um, so I have so many, <laughs> so many memorable recording experiences that um, I wouldn't even know where to start. Um, I, you know, I just this summer I was detained in Cuba. Uh, my wife and I, she was taking pictures, and I was standing. Uh, I didn't want to stand in the sidewalk. I was standing in, the, you know, it was like seven or eight in the morning, and I was recording morning traffic in Havana, in a suburb. And so I didn't want to stand on the sidewalk because people walk by. I don't want to get in their way. So I have my microphones out and kind of standing there quietly. And a security guard comes up to me and, and says, I, I want you to, he, I don't speak great Spanish, and very poor Spanish, and uh, he doesn't speak English. So he says, I want you to stay here. And then he calls the police. So the police come and they keep me for there for two hours. And... They're asking me questions and what am I doing? And I'm saying, you know, sonidos efectos, sonidos efectos. You know, that's what I'm doing. Well, it turns out that the building I was standing next to was a hospital. And it's against the law to record anything near a government building. So after two hours with them, they took me to immigration. Um, and then they interrogated my wife and I for two hours <laughs> with Che Guevara looking down on him. So... Wow. And the whole time I was just going like, oh my god, I hope they don't take my microphone recording. 